This people draweth nigh unto me with their mouth, and honoureth me with their lips, but their heart is far from me. But in vain do they worship me, teaching for doctrines the commandments of men. Hi. When Jesus spoke these words about the Pharisees in Matthew chapter 15, he was merely echoing words he had spoken some 700 years earlier through the prophet Isaiah. We find this in Isaiah chapter 29 and verse 13. So the Pharisees had laid in the Jewish religion with so many forms and functions that were man-made that it seemed impossible to attain salvation. But Jesus had come to cut through that noise and to show that salvation was something he would accomplish for mankind. John 3 chapter 16 tells us this, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believes should not perish but have everlasting life. Verse 17 goes on to say, For God did not send his Son to condemn the world, but that through his Son the world might be saved. Everything for our salvation was obtained by God. We have nothing that we can add to it because we are sheep in iniquity and born in sin, as David put it in Psalms chapter 51. And so, God has already done everything to attain our salvation. What a tragic waste it would be for us to not accept it by our unbelief. Don't you want to accept Jesus as your Savior today? God bless you.